Hi folks, I am at the Hall of Fame RV Park in Tulsa, Oklahoma. I'm literally right around the corner from Route 44 through the center of town. And uh, it's, a, it's a little tight, uh, but it is functional. And, uh, and it's certainly gonna be a little windy while I give you, the, give you the tour. But looking around, sharing behind me here, kind of a you know quiet easy going neighborhood appears to be getting in was uh, you, you had to come in go back to the, back to the counter back to the office and uh, all of the spots are back in gonna show you that in a minute so I came in the front gate made my way around up to the back to the office got checked in and then made my way to the site. Like I said, the sites are tight. They are all back in sites. Uh, it says you were to have room for one vehicle. I challenge that assertion. But on the other hand, there's parking right up at the office. So if you're towing, you can drop your tag and, and uh, park it up there at the office. Um, everybody else is trying to claim space. And uh, I find that intriguing when everybody else is driving pickup trucks, some of which are one-ton crew cab dually long bids. So um, I would suggest if you're here, making sure that you uh, are aware of where all parking actually exists. Based on my amazing level of deductive reasoning, or you know, you can stumble on yourself and still figure this one out, they just added all the rest of these spaces and uh, it is solid and the power there, that side of it is also solid. I'm, I see that there's already one active trailer up in the row. So this is another or an additional row of space available. So there's Doc. Uh, no folks didn't bother to move for me. And yes, I did get it in there without wrinkling anything. Uh, it did, however, take me a, a couple of rounds of backing forward, backing forward. Anyway, I did get it in there. Um, the hookups were clean and neat. We're going to go over there in a minute. And the space itself is solid. This is on the older side, but the concrete or asphalt is certainly passable and functional. So you can see the hookups. They're in good shape. Looks like the plumbing had been redone very recently. The power, these are new pedestals. So this too has been done very, very recently. And as said, the locations based on what your vehicle type is certainly works. Um, but the space a little bit tight. Directly across the street is the Hard Rock Hotel, Casino, and Resort in Tulsa, Oklahoma. That may be the dinner destination. We'll see. There is on and off ramp right at 44 that drops into the street. Uh, well, excuse me, drops to the north-south, which then you make one turn and you are here. So very, very convenient for getting in and out from that perspective. We are going to give this uh, Hall of Fame Route 66 in Tulsa, we're gonna give it a thumb sideways. Um, mechanically, very tight. Uh, there was room to put the slides out, but you saw in the video really kinda crumple together here. I am uh, more than happy with arrival. The gentleman that checked me in was, was very nice, very pleasant pointed me in the right direction and said, have at it. So I did. Um, I would say that this, uh, uh, the additions, they, the additional space that they put in and their attention to the uh, mechanicals has been good, uh, but the, the rest of the space, the slot pads themselves and the um, kind of the, the roadways in and through uh, ha could use some attention. Uh, but long and the short of it is, if you're here for an overnight and need a place to stay, or you're here for a couple days, need a place to stay, um, you certainly have no no 
challenges or concerns from a, you know, a parking lot with hookups. And that's what you get. So, all for now.